it's time to move into the day. It's going to give me great pleasure to introduce you uh, in a moment to uh, Tony. Tony has spent uh, 13 years um, building an online business um, in, a, in a very, very highly competitive marketplace. And really what today is all about um, is answering Tony's great wish to be able to help other entrepreneurs and business people like him um, to achieve the same level of success online that he's been able to do. Um, I think it's been a great benefit to the business. Um, I've learned a lot on the actual uh, website marketing side, uh, but also the flaws of where my website and the business isn't doing what we should be. We do live in a changing world. It, it is important that we do keep on top of things, and that we adapt and respond to these. And probably the biggest challenge that we all face in, in recent years is the internet and social media. Um, if you're anyway inclined in sort of um, blogging or updating your own website, or if you're interested in that sort of thing, then this is going to give you invaluable tips um, and tools to do that. You need to do three things, and three things only. You need to prospect, convert, and grow. And it's like a mantra. If you just think about these all the time. Um, today's been of great benefit. It's demystified a lot of the jargon around how to look after your website and it's given me loads of tips of how to improve the ranking of my blog and various things that I do online. Free is a powerful word and if you understand what the biggest issue of your customer is then you can offer them something which addresses that issue. I think it's actually made me and the senior partner think about um, not just what we can be doing but the things that we're not doing. When people come to your, to your website in particular, you need, you need to make sure they leave with that impression. These are the guys that offer me this, that promise me this, that do this for me. None of this welcome to my website, you know, it's just... Ugh. I think the main thing has been, it's actually given me a list of priorities of things that I need to approach first. How we think about things causes how we feel. How we feel determines the action we take or don't take and that determines the results we get and if we get really good results we say wow I did brilliant on that and that's when we get in the zone and we're going to get more fantastic results again. Excellent use of my time, I very rarely take time out of work to come to training so it's been very very useful today. These thoughts made up of two things, pictures we make in our minds and self-talk. The one thing you can say to you, take away from this today is that you're not the only one, everyone natters to themselves 24-7 in their head. We all do this is a right. You're not the only one, we all do it. The problem is, and those of you there sitting there thinking, because there will be a few, there's always a few, what a load of rubbish, I don't, you're doing it now. <laughs> well, it's given me a lot of ideas, um, and I can't wait to get back and get started and get them all implemented. I found it very helpful today. It's given me direction. Absolutely, I'd recommend it to somebody else. Um, I think people need to know about this.